The best day of my life was when I got arrested, and I know not many people will say that, but for me it was. My whole life has changed. So I'm a mother of nine. I've got eight grandchildren. I've been addicted to drugs and alcohol since I was 14 due to childhood trauma. And I used alcohol as a coping mechanism and drugs. And I um, was very high functioning on the outside, but on the inside I was pretty broken and battered. So, yeah. I was 52 when I was arrested. If I wanted to get any value out of the rest of my life and not be hurting anymore, then it was time to do something. I just didn't have the courage. I reached out from the jail and asked them to do an assessment on me and they notified me that I was accepted. So I applied for bail from the jail to, um, to come here. I started to do a little bit of research on the Salvation Army and where it come from and um, in our spiritual awareness and reflections classes that um, the on-site chaplain runs, we learn about um, William Booth and, and how it came to be and, and it really interested me, like the start, and I just thought what an amazing organisation and to support everything they do here, everything they do through the church, it's just, they're amazing. Like, yeah, I can't even begin to tell you what I feel about them. They're just fantastic. My case manager, along with every other staff member here, have encouraged me, especially because I started studying. Who else has 15 staff members that can help you with your study? Because I'm doing um, Cert 4 in community service. Um, I just find them, they're patient, they're kind, they're compassionate, they're, they go above and beyond their job. I couldn't have imagined my journey so far without each and every one of them.